In this assertion reason based question, it says assertion says that the perimeter of triangle, I mean the triangle given over here, is a rational number. So you know that perimeter of a triangle is what? The sum of the lengths of three sides. So if I have to get the perimeter, I'll say it should be AB plus the length of BC plus AC. Well, what you can see here, we do not know the length of AC. But since it is a right angle triangle, we can apply Pythagoras theorem to get the length of AC. So let's see if I find the square of AC, it should be what? AB square plus BC square. Now, length of AB is 4, so it's going to be 4 square, and BC is 3, so it's 3 square. Finally, AC square is equal to 16 plus 9, so that comes out to be, as you know, AC square will come as 25, that implies AC is 5. Now, if I replace this length here with 5, now we continue finding the perimeter as you know AB which is 4 here, BC which is 3 and AC which is 5. Now check here if I add these numbers, right? 5 plus 3, 8 plus 4, 12. So this is 12 centimeter. Now the question said here that the perimeter, the assertion said that the perimeter is a rational number. Perimeter what we got is 12 and 12 is a rational number. So we can say that here the assertion is right. Assertion is correct. Then when I re read the reason, it says sum of the squares of two rational number is always rational. Check here, we found the sum of the squares of two rational number. That is 4 is a rational number, 3 is a rational number. And if I add the sum of their square, we get 5, which is a rational number. But this is not always true. It is not always true, as you can see. If I replace this 4 with 2, if I replace, as you can see, I've replaced this 4 with 2. Now check here. If I have to get the length of AC, I would have said it is 2 square plus 3 square. This is 4 plus 9. And then AC will get under root 13. Now you check this is not a under root 13. As, as its decimal expansion is non-terminating, non-recurring. So therefore, we'll say that assertion is correct, but reason is wrong. And this is because the sum of the squares of two rational number can be a rational number or an irrational number.